Hey guys, it's me Astrid and today I was a little bit naughty and I went and bought a bunch of orchids from Trader Joe's. Now these orchids, I got two Phalaenopsis orchids and I can't believe I did that but I think if you're looking at this fowl now that you can see, you'll understand why I got this particular orchid. Now this Phalaenopsis, let's just have a little look see here at the flowers so these flowers are this faded pastel veined pink color their lip is really what got me i mean let's just zoom in on this and really appreciate the wonder of this this lip here it's got this gorgeous shape and form the orchid is just so soft and nice the leaves are beautiful the flowers are really big and i'm in love also these buds are all healthy and formed and i'm not going to repot it for now so i can avoid any risk of the buds blasting but they're all opening and it looks like they start out with a bit of a yellow color before they open but i'm so 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 excited about this fowl and honestly, I'm really in shock that I'm excited about a Phalaenopsis. Let's get close in on this flower. You can see the color is just sparkling. It's, you can definitely see if you have like high quality video right now, probably, that this is just this sparkly, wonderful plant. But something very exciting about this Phalaenopsis that's even better than anything I've seen on a fowl before is this little surprise. So if we're looking down here under the leaves, I'm gonna zoom out a little bit. So if we're looking down here under the leaves, the leaves are purple underneath. It has this edema problem. I'll probably just cut this part of the leaf off, but I'm not too worried about that. Um, where is it? Where is it? Look at this. The growing root tips on this Phalaenopsis orchid are pink. And it's not just a little bit, it's like the whole tip is pink. And I pulled this out and I could see on other spots of the plant where it had some growth tips, if I can find them, that, look at that, bam, pink root tip. There's some others around the pot, but it's like super exciting for me. And this new leaf that has grown in is super fat, it looks good, but yeah, I, I am in love with this orchid. I don't know why, but hey. Next, we'll look at the second Phalaenopsis orchid that I got. I'm sorry for my like weird camera work right now. This little orchid, and I've been looking at these for a while. It looks like a little some kind of Phal Equestris hybrid. Look at that. First, these blooms are adorable. They're very sweet, very small. And this is just bursting with buds. There's so many, there's gonna be so many flowers on this and it just looks wonderful. But what really caught my eye on this one, if you haven't noticed it yet, are the mottled leaves. Yes, I found this at Trader Joe's. It has mottled leaves and this is really exciting for me. Even when it's out of bloom, it's gonna look great and the undersides of these leaves are purple. It's just, this is a great foliage plant, so even if the blooms aren't extremely impressive, the foliage is just totally what's doing it for me right now. Like, oh my goodness. Foliage, blooms. Foliage, blooms. I'm sorry, I'm playing with my zoom on my camera. I'm too excited. And the last special orchid that I found today is one like I already have, like you might have already seen. It's this Paphiopetalum nivium hybrid. Now, I didn't like this one because it was a bit tall. I like the nivium because they're just so short in their stem. This one happens to be tall, but have you noticed this yet? Look, it has a second flower bud coming off of this flower stalk. Let's zoom in so we get a really good perspective on this. So it has the cuppy shape, and right here off this stalk, there's another bud forming. I saw this last week when I was shopping at Trader Joe's for orchids, and I said, 
that's not what I said, excuse me. I said, oh gosh, this has two buds, I should get it. And I said, no, no, but this time I didn't pass it up. I'm totally getting it and I'm totally not regretting it. Look at that. The last thing I wanna show you about this orchid though is its foliage because I love good foliage on an orchid. Now look at this, it's got the typical mottled leaves of a Paphnivium type, however, if we flip them over, these are almost black purple. They are super, super dark. Now we can look at my other Paphnivium. This one is a little bit less healthy. I don't know how well it's gonna do, I might sell it. But if we look under here, the leaves are this reddish purple color. But this one, it's probably the same exact cross. Just look, look at the undersides of the leaves. It's, it's really magnificent. Is that, it's stunning. It's just stunning. So these are the orchids that I bought today. I guess you can say I finished my final exam, so maybe I deserve a treat, but really, we all know it's part of the obsession. We can't help ourselves. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video and thanks so much for watching. Have a nice day and happy growing. Bye guys.